M0FXB, welcome to my channel and my videos on the ICOM ID52. FXB, so you're in DR mode and you want to sort of search different repeaters. So right now, A and B, look. A, B, A, B. Let's put it in just one, in one single receive. It's simpler. Although the 52 will receive two lots of DR mode on A and B simultaneously. So... At the moment, we've, we're in, we've got the to at the top and we've got the from at the bottom highlighted in light blue. We can change it up and down like that. So let's say we want to select a repeater. So let's go down and click select. And you can look at TX history if you want, DV or FM. But what we're interested in is finding a repeater near us. So look, near repeater. And then we could select all, I suppose. Let's select all. And it will search and it will find one. So, and you can see the call signs listed here GB7CD. You know, if it has a six or a seven, I'm pretty sure that will be either a link or a repeat or a, a digital link or digital repeat. I think. Not sure, but anyway, let's just select. If you select it, the radio will put all the settings in you need to talk to it. So if you've driven to Bristol for the day or London, you can use this system. So let's select Cardiff and look straight away, you're in there. And, and at the top half should be user reflector. Now, if you say you have connected to that repeater and you, you know, you can talk to some, but you want to change the reflector that the repeater is on, you just go to the two thing, click use, reflector and click link to reflector and you can actually let's say we select reflector 30 and you key like that and then you can you're in range you will actually switch the repeater um to reflector 30 and but to, for people to hear you you just need to remember to select it again hit reflector and get use reflector you always have to be use reflector and then let's just say you did that and you you, you wanted to get back to your hotspot so just go down, hit Cardiff, select TX History, and as long as this isn't the first time you've used the radio, go to TX History DV and look for whatever you called your hotspot. So we've got, I've named one hotspot and one open spot. So we'll go to my open spot. And that's it, we're back to using our, our hotspot at home. So I hope this helps for finding near repeaters and then reconnecting to your home hotspot. 7-3, all the best. Thanks very much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it and you find it helpful, please hit that like button and subscribe. 7-3, all the best.